Hello everyone, it's a style by Sammy and if you're new here watching me, my name is Samiha. So today makeup it's gonna be a bit different uh, because I'm just gonna create one summer look. Uh, in, if you're living in back home, we all know that there's always been a summer and uh, stays in here. So it's a very normal for us, but uh, those who are living in uh, different countries like abroad, it's uh, kind of like a summer coming uh, probably after one month later. It's just in the corner. So I thought I'm just gonna create one summer look. So today I'm just gonna work on the face area. We're gonna keep it the eye a bit clear, you know, and then you're gonna go, we're gonna do some like soft pink lipstick on our lips. So yeah, so just gonna work on face. Uh, eye would be mineral. So because it's summer, you don't have to put, like you don't want to put like too much makeup on your eye. You want, like people always like to, you know, put, very like a clean and plain makeup uh, during the summer day so I thought let's create a look so can I start the look let's just get started so first thing come first uh, I just always done my eyebrow first and then my foundation and concealer you're gonna apply on later so I'm just gonna do quickly draw my eyebrow just holding the mirror in front of my face and you guys can watching me on that from that camera so just like that I'm just creating the lines so the ombre texture like I always follow that uh, darker would be my uh, this area towards to the front I keep it uh, lighter okay so all darker and deeper Let's just like that Okay. So the eyebrows done. Uh, just finished the two eyebrows, and then I'm just gonna using the uh, two faced uh, round this way, and my color is natural beige. Uh, there's a, some reason. My last makeup tutorial video, I uploaded all the information, uh, what product I've used in my video i put on the description box uh, below all the products and everything but it didn't show up and i felt so bad because you guys probably doesn't know that what brand i've used and which product i'm using i have no idea what what exactly you know wrong happened but that's why i'm just showing you right now uh what product i'm using uh it's a two-faced for some reason i don't know because i'm editing and uploading the video from the camera from the like uh, my phone camera because of that i have no idea why it's happening but uh it's it, it you know it felt really bad because i had done all the hard work and it didn't show up when i like upload the video on the youtube it doesn't it didn't show up anything you know i planned it out everything uh the concealer okay now i'm using the mac face and body foundations all of my favorite my color is c3 i'm gonna blend it all over my face i'm just using the finger to put it to apply on my the finger because it's a liquid foundation so all you need to do you can just use your finger first and then you can blend it out just like that i have so much blemishes on my face uh which is for every day every single day for like whole eat week i have been doing my makeup i'm just going with it and it was so hot the weather is so hot I, because of that reason i just got some breakouts and some blemishes so you're gonna hide that spot when i see the foundation is all blind i'm just gonna pop on some concealer on my blemishes and my like a breakouts areas i uh, just put it on just a little bit and just gonna uh, use my foundation sponge just to hide all the blemishes and breakouts just like that okay uh, very recently I have noticed when I apply my concealer and foundations before like when I used to do my makeup I always use like the blush and I just good to go I just use some dust powder like a loose powder on my face my face looks so clean and fresh but because of the humid and the summer weather just like Bangladesh all you need to do uh, i just follow this technique i think just follow follow this technique guys at home probably you're just gonna get benefited just like me so now i just apply the concealer and foundations now i'm just gonna put some laura Mercier loose powder on top of my face just a little bit this gives you that you know the holding 
like holding holding this on your face you will feel that literally your face is just you know holding all the concealer and foundations on your face very nicely and it's not gives you that you know uh bakiness or not gives you any like you know sweat face just like that now you see my face is looking really like a sweaty and uh, muddy muddy kind of uh, texture i'm having right now but i'm gonna use this loose powder i'm just gonna using this much just only you know put it on the brush tap it and then apply it on your face just like that okay and it just gives you immediately that holdingness compared to this one if you can see this face okay, i'll show you i will show you i'm gonna put more just just tap like this on your face area forehead areas and the eye area uh, under underneath of your eye and then your cheekbones and everywhere compared to okay i'm gonna put a little bit more okay just to show you just like that this much and just gonna tap the brush like that and then tap like this and then put it just do it very gently okay don't don't put too much powder on your face don't pressurize you know don't use the brush just like that you know don't do that very gently put it like this apply like that okay so now if you see compared to this one this is looking more subtle more glowy still i have the glowness on my face but it still it's look more subtle compared to this one so this technique i was just applying all the summer you know the hot weather because of the like eat eat week the whole eat week it's been like so much hot the weather is so hot and i applied this technique it's literally helped me a lot you know because and i just i just can realize can feel it my foundation is holding much more longer than usual okay so apply on your forehead on your eye areas and on your cheekbones just like that and you need this type of buffing brush to to do that okay so just tap just a little bit and you can see the result immediately it's look how nice and beautiful the skin is looking it's just looking so fresh it doesn't even look that you wear any foundation any concealer it just gives you immediately like the freshness on your face when i will completely done i'm gonna put more uh loose powder on my face just we're gonna work on our face area first so i'm gonna using this a contour palette from anastasia uh the cream control this is a creamy texture i'm gonna use this one and darker one just probably on this area a little bit i'll show you how i'm applying it so i'm just gonna show you just like that i'm just taking this color okay and cutting my cheekbones so i'm starting from here as basically and then i'm just gonna put some on my forehead okay because like i said i'm just gonna work on my face area to control nicely my face and then uh, we're gonna work on eye after that it gives you that very fresh looking skin and you'll see that your face gonna look more like you know shaved and everything and whole look it's gonna feel like no makeup makeup look kind of situation you know and your skin gonna look more healthier and then i'm gonna use this one this color on the corner to give you to give that more dark control on these cheek areas a little bit on the forehead the nose areas and i'm gonna use a little bit on my eyelid as well just a little bit not too much just like that okay and then i'm gonna blend it out for blending i'm using this mac uh 240s it's a like kind of pointing brush and it's good to like uh, blending controlling and everything it's a very good brush and i'm just gonna blend everything out so what i'm gonna do is just coming back and forward and then round circle this is kind of my technique i always apply like this like i always use this technique whenever i apply a con uh, like face controlling thing and i'm gonna blend it out here as well the nose area okay and then the forehead and top of that i'm gonna use some bronzer to contour my face like the loose powder still you guys can see it just the makeup 
my look at my face just right now it's still looking just looking so fresh you know and exactly all you need this is exactly like all you need for summer because we all want the face look fresh and breathe right because you don't want that bakiness on your face so this is like a very good way to kind of doing your makeup and this is kind of like a new technique I'm applying like after foundation the loose powder technique it just gives you that that freshness that you're really looking for your face okay so now I'm going to uh, use some more loose powder okay uh, on my face the Laura Marcia one I'm just gonna grab some more and then uh, clean these areas just like that using this powder I need a couple of more uh, the forehead areas okay. and, uh, okay, just like that. Uh, the makeup is looking so fresh now uh, from Smashbox the Cali Kissed I'm using the pink shade just this one on uh, just uh, on my cheekbone just a brush just a little bit not too much because i want to make sure my makeup is looking fresh and clean see you later palette uh the name is valid vas i'm gonna use uh this uh coral kiss color i will show you this color it's a very soft kind of uh, i'm just pink. using this same brush to apply the shade on my eye because i'm just up uh, like a popping you know this shade on my eye so i'm not looking for any shape nothing it's just uh popping on my eye just like that you know sorry to say guys in my description box below there is no nothing no brand is showing i have no idea for some reason probably it's not showing up that's why i'm just showing you all the products uh on my video what i'm using which one i'm applying so that you can get some idea what product I'm using. Now I'm gonna curl my lashes. Okay, I'm gonna curl my lashes with this curling uh, machine. I just got this one from MAC. I'm gonna curl the lashes. Okay, uh, uh, double wear mascara. Okay, that's why I'm just telling you all the product on my uh, video because, sorry about that. Uh, there's something probably went wrong okay so applying this mascara and then i'm gonna apply the false lashes the false lashes i'm using uh this one kiss uh these lashes i'm gonna use today the whole lashes I use on underneath on my lashes just a little bit not too much okay. so i pop on the lashes uh it's uh, looking beautiful now i'm gonna apply the lipstick using the mac cork one of my favorite lip liner and then i'm gonna use this uh nyx uh shine loud this color they have like a two color one is matte and it's a gloss you can apply that on I'm my just lip. drawing my lip liner a little bit like a big way this is something that i always do okay i'm just applying the lip liner on my lips okay. always draw my lip liner just like this way Okay, you can make it some V and then apply it like this. So you feel like super dry, just like that. Now you have to apply this, uh, like a liquid gloss, this one on top of your lips. So then it will give you uh, that uh, glossy, lip glossy kind of feeling, just like that. Okay. Before I really didn't like this lip, lip uh, like lipstick because it feel like. Feel like it's so dry but when i apply this one it feel like 
so beautiful and so nice now i really love these lipsticks so it's from like nyx ashine loud uh, i really love this color so yeah guys so this is like the final look i think hope you like this look and um, just subscribe my page if you like this look or you want to see more uh, makeup tutorial from me so just uh, subscribe my page and uh, ha like hit the bell button so whenever i upload a new video you can see it so this is the final look guys thank you so much for you watching i'll see you next time thank you bye bye